please pause this video and answer the question before continuing. In this question, we want to determine how many milliliters of solution X must be added to 250 milliliters of solution W so that the resulting solution is 40% salt by volume. So let's begin by sketching 250 milliliters of solution W with the water and salt separated. Now the question tells us that solution W is 20% salt by volume. Since 20% of 250 milliliters is 50 milliliters, we know that there is 50 milliliters of salt in the solution. This means that the remaining 200 milliliters of the solution must be water. Next we have solution X, which we will also draw with the salt and water separated. Since we are trying to determine the required volume of solution X, let's say that there is X milliliters of the solution. Now the question tells us that solution X is 80% salt by volume. So if there is X milliliters of this solution, and 80% of this volume is salt, then we know that there is 0.8X milliliters of salt in the solution. Conversely, if the solution is 80% salt, then the remaining 20% must be water. So if there is X milliliters of solution and 20% of this volume is water, then we know that there is 0.2x milliliters of water in the solution. Now when we add these two solutions, we get a new solution. To determine the various volumes of this new solution, we will combine like parts. First, since we are combining 250 milliliters of solution W with X milliliters of solution X, the new solution must have a volume of 250 plus X milliliters. Next, since solution W has 50 milliliters of salt and solution X has 0.8 milliliters of salt, the new solution must have a total of 50 plus 0.8 milliliters of salt. Finally, since solution W contains 200 milliliters of water and solution X contains 0.2x milliliters of water, the new solution must contain 200 plus 0.2x milliliters of water. Now the question concerns the concentration of salt in the new solution, which we can represent with the following fraction. The volume of salt in the new solution is 50 plus 0.8x milliliters, and the total volume of the new solution is 250 plus x milliliters. We are told that this concentration must equal 40%, which we can write as 40 over 100. At this point, we have an equation we can solve for x. First, let's simplify the right-hand side to be 2 fifths. From here we can cross multiply to get the following, and then we can expand both sides. Now we can subtract 2x from both sides, then subtract 250 from both sides, and then divide both sides by 2 to get x equals 125. Since x equals the number of milliliters of solution x, our answer must be d.